Hi everyone, this is Matt Felderman with American Expedition Vehicles and today we're going to walk through the skid plate package on the Bison. Now this is definitely one of the most talked about features of the Bison because it's truly a front to back skid plate system designed to protect the most vulnerable areas of the truck on rocky technical terrain. Now keeping both added weight and strength in mind, we went with hot stamp boron steel. The advantage of this is it's extremely strong, lightweight, and very resistant to gouging. Basically this is kind of the perfect material for skid plates. Now the first two skid plates I want to point out are basically specific to the front bumper. This is basically what we call skid 1A and 1B. Skid 1A is a traditional uh, cold stamped mild steel piece. Skid 1B is the start of the hot stamp boron steel skid plates. Now these skid plates are basically designed to be the first point of impact off-road. If you're getting over obstacles they're going to take the hit not the bumper itself. And in here this is the access uh, port to get to the clutch handle on the winch when you want to release that. Now moving further back on the vehicle we get to the engine skid plate. Now this skid plate is essentially the same identical skid plate that's found on the standard ZR2 except that is an aluminum skid plate. This is hot stamp boron steel. So not only is it stronger, it's also more resistant to gouging, which is perfect when you're trying to slide over something. Continuing towards the back, we have the transmission skid plate. Now this is the one skid plate that doesn't come factory equipped on the Bison. This is a accessory that we'll be offering as well as GM through their accessory catalog. Now, you're going to notice that this looks completely different than all our other skid plates because it is a series of tubes. This is seven one-inch DOM tubes, and the reason they're tubes is to comply with GM's cooling requirement for the transmission oil pan, as well as to make sure that debris doesn't get packed up in there and potentially be a fire hazard. Now, while we're also back in this area, I'm also going to talk about the one skid plate that I can't show you because this is a diesel truck. Gas bisons are going to come equipped with an exhaust crossover skid plate. So this truck doesn't have one, but gas bisons do. The next skid plate in line is the transfer case skid plate. This skid plate not only protects the transfer case, but also the ABS module, the fuel filter, and the DEF drain plug on diesel truck application. Now, this skid plate's not really designed to protect the fuel tank from getting crushed, since the fuel rails do a really good job of protecting it. So what this really is designed for is to protect the fuel tank from getting punctured or damaging the fuel pump, which is in the rear, and this part of the skid plate is actually reinforced a little bit extra for that reason. Now the last skid plate we're gonna take a look at is the differential skid plate. Now we really here at AEV have been referring to these as a differential slider for years because really they're designed to do just that. Slide over the obstacle, maintain your momentum while also protecting uh, things like the stamped uh, differential cover which is often prone to getting peeled back by rocks. Now we also take into consideration right here that the drive shaft still needs to operate throughout its entire range of motion and we supply a easy access hole so you can get to the drain plug nice and easy. So thanks for watching. Be sure to like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and visit www.aevconversions.com.